After a little while, the, they found something. Red Pikmin tried to carry it, but it's a bit too heavy. Leave Warlock walked up to him and helped him out. As they brought it to the ship, it started reacting. Then, the ship reacted back. Then, it flipped right back. Flipped back up. Then all of a sudden, it just went like this. It literally went inside the ship. And it upgraded its technology progress. And it updated the map as well. But, then they kept on looking for stuff to power it up. Then, well, they found another sprout popping out of the ground. Just started, just sat there. Just wiggling there. Link walked up to it and plucked it out of the ground. This time it was a different color Pikmin. A yellow Pikmin to be exact. To be more specific, it looked around, and then it ran off. So they decided to chase after it. Yellow Pikmin, the yellow Pikmin that they found had a flower on its head, which meant it was really fast. Link could barely keep up with it. Red can couldn't even keep up with it because he had a leaf on his head. Then they ran into two sprouts. Two Pikmin just standing there. Chat, chat. They ran into two Pikmin just standing there, chatting to one another. Link whistled for them, but they didn't respond. They were too busy in their conversation. The only way to get their attention was just like to, like, bump into them. But Link didn't want to interrupt their conversation at all. The Red Pikmin finally caught up with Link. He was literally panting his breath out. So then, they chased after the yellow again. But, this time, they literally walked right in front of them and literally blocked them in their path. Red Pikmin asked them to move, but they refused to move. And you wanna know what? And, they were holding something. It was a Yokai Watch U prototype. They had no idea what it was, but it, but, Red Pikmin asked what's it for, and Blue, and what Blue Pikmin said was, this actually upgrades your ship, right? But it cost, it takes three Pikmin to carry it. So then they brought it back to their ship and it looked up. So then they brought it back to the ship and it went like right inside and jumped, and it updated its map and located where the yellow Pikmin was. It was literally right up here, really close by. They went up to it, but it was fast asleep. The only way to wake it up was to just like smack it, smack it awake. But Link just shook it to wake it up, and it woke up, realized it, and then ran off. This time, that direction, and then they chased after it again. Red Pikmin asked it for to stop, but Link just stood, stood put. But then he decided to chase after him. After a little while, they ran into a, they ran into a monster, a giant red bird, which was asleep. Well, yellow people didn't know no, was that it was actually a monster, and it, and it just touched it, which woke it up. And it was pretty. And when it woke up, it was mad, and it literally tried to eat yellow. Link just got in there, but took out his sword and just sliced it. Which did two damage. He grabbed Yellow and ran off with him. The monster fell back asleep. Then they came back. This time the Yellow cooperated and listened to whatever Link said. So they had an idea. Why not attack? Wapping well, had the perfect spot. It literally tiptoed on. And just literally attacked the eye, which literally was, was which was literally the weak point, and got it really ticked. And it was pretty mad after that happened. But then he called White back, which he which obeyed. And then they had 
Then Yellow had the had an idea. He literally just started attacking it like crazy. And it started jerking around like a round horse. And a like also like a bull. Yellow Pikmin barely could hold on. And then that, uh, eventually he fell off. And also it also defeated the monster as well. Victory. But after it when it defeated it dropped this. It dropped the glasses. He whistled for the Pikmin to carry it. It only required one Pikmin to carry. Cause it was that light. It 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 cost at least ten it it actually gave so it gave the player the ability to see where his partner is right now, at the moment. So we used it, and it was literally far away from here. So then he took him off, and then the sun started setting, and it said this. Hurry up. Gather all your Pikmin before the sun sets. I mean, was for all the Pikmin to be close. And they headed back to their ship. And the and all the Pikmin just charged right into the ship. They were on day two of their adventure. But. They were not. He put on the glasses and he was like really close by. But they didn't know how to get to him. But. They really need to find treasure. To really important stuff to help him get out. And he was literally turned into a nice sculpture. <laughs> by a By a bad. By a monster. Which, you know, is Ice Beam. And literally frozen solid. <laughs> <coughs> anyway. And. And they'll find more parts in episode 2. So, peace. Hope you guys enjoyed this. And please. Leave a like, comment, and subscribe. Bye.